Hi, it's Ron Heinlein with DTFFootwear.com. Okay, and again, I'm in my office, and what I'm trying to do is, I, again, what I said on the other two videos, I, my individuals handling my videos and different things, and other people weren't too impressed with my first videos coming out the uh, gate uh, in the sense of the live videos. Uh, too much ceiling, too much this, not enough of me or my body, so we're redoing these. And what I want to talk about on this insert is something very important to me, and that's excuse me, on what I want to talk about, the videos, I should say, I'm jumping ahead, I go, what am I doing, is inserts. Why do I keep talking about these heat moldable customized inserts? Uh, we just happen to give away free three sets, and we happen to be the only internet that gives away three of them. I don't even know anybody gives one away, but three of them, three sets we give away for every time you purchase a pair of shoes. But why am I so enthused about it? Okay, let's start the story by saying very simple. 60% of footwear comfort is derived from the insert, okay? Yes, the shoe has to be there. And I've told you this before on videos. If the top of your foot, and I, I ask these to nurses, I get stopped all the time with the medical company. Nurses will say, Ron, my feet are killing me. My first question is where? If it's the top of your foot, you have an ill-fitting shoe, okay? Your shoe just isn't fitting. You don't have the width. You don't have the depth. You don't have a lot of things, uh, and you're just it's not fitting. Now, if the bottom of your feet hurt, and or they've got calluses, or if they've got heel spurs, or they're just tired, or they're sore after an eight-hour shift or whatever, you don't have any support underneath. Now, I've got some props here. I'm going to try to do this without taking my aid. This is a normal insert. I took this out of one of my pair of shoes a long time ago. Let me see if I can see where you guys can see it. Look how thin this is, okay? And how, I mean, it bends all over the place, okay? That's a normal insert, okay? Let's take our heat moldable insert that we provide Look at the thickness of this. Look at how much. It's three times thicker, four times thicker, and I can compare them hopefully here. It's four times thicker than this, this normal insert, and it's got a good raised arch. It's got a great what we call a cradle heel in there. It's got a T-bar to it. It's got all the support, and look, I mean, it, 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 it's got it, – it's sturdy little puppy. It's sturdy puppy. And this material, as I've said before, molds to your foot. It actually customizes to your foot. The more you wear it, it actually develops. And that's where the heat customized concept comes. And it cradles right to all your foot indentations, the places where you need to offload. So this is very important. This is very important. Now, if I put this because of the thickness, and we have one of the thickest, or what we call durometer, in the over-counter insert concept, and it, but if you put this in a normal shoe, and first of all, if it doesn't have a removable footbed, forget that. But if it does, and you put it in there, we'll maybe squeeze and make that, sh that shoe isn't developed for this type of insert. It isn't constructed for this type of insert. And so basically it takes a proper footwear to make this ha happen. If you're diabetic, this is so important. Even if you're on ambulatory that you're uh, bedridden is another story, but if you're in a wheelchair, your feet are touching this material and this material raises your uh, foot up temperature-wise 2% and generates circulation. And this circulation creates the disease to stay out of the foot. And I have videos I've talked about my dad and everything, and I'm not going to go into this from that point, but it does keep the disease out of the foot. And when you stop wearing them like my dad did before he passed away and came with two ulcerations, never had ulcerations, never had ulcerations when he was wearing our shoes, and especially our inserts, loved our inserts. Uh, from that point. I mean, he got spoiled if he ever didn't. Uh, but again, 
uh, this is important for diabetics as well. It's important for runners because of the heel cup. When you run, you land on your heel. All your weight lands on your heel. Then it distributes through the arch and it lands into the metatarsal. And you need this durometer and your padding. These last four months, if you wear them every day, that's why you get three sets from us. Yeah, you know, other people should do it. But they want to make money, okay? I I make a few dollars off the shoes. I don't make a dime off of these, but in turn, it gives you a chance to understand what, what it's all about. Let me show you my insert that I use all the time. It's basically the same thing, except I just used a different cover on it. And it's been a great, great, and I wear them all the time. And all my shoes got a great, still flexibility, but doesn't wobble as much as this thing does. And I love it. It's got the metatarsal here. It's got everything. It's got the T-bar here. It's got the cradle heel. Well, this is the same thing. So we just put a different cover on it. And I love mine. I love mine. I mean, you can see how these things have been worn. I mean, I wear these like crazy, and I'm going to have to eventually get a new pair of them uh, from that point. But what I'm trying to tell you is that, yeah, these heat moldable customized inserts are very important, and they make the difference of what your pressure. If you got calluses, why on the bottom of your feet? Because you're beating the tar out of that particular area of your foot and the over skin overlay is trying to protect itself saying hey 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 ron you keep beating me on here give me some relief once you do and then i can tell you how to uh get rid of that in time instead of shaving it because it's going to come back it's going to come back you have corns and that doesn't have to do as much i mean the insert will help but corns is usually you're squeezing your toes and that's protection between the toes you need some room you always need to wiggle in our shoes you wiggle your toesies wiggle all the time from that aspect of it so also if you have a heel spur i've talked about that in other videos how to prevent and how to offload the heel spur and so on and like i said if you're on your feet nurses Oh my gosh, my nurses, they love the shoes. And we can provide the prices a lot more reasonable than I can through the medical field because of the restrictions we have on the medical concept. So that's where I have the web website. And then I realized all the widths, all the sizes, and everything else that we've got. Uh, we have just created a monster and it's been fun and it keeps growing and everything else from that point. So remember, the inserts are almost 60% of the comfort of a footwear. And without them, you might as well be walking on basically a noium floor. And that's how important these inserts are. And again, if you ever ask me, my feet are hurting, my first answer or my first question I should say is where, top or bottom? Then we know what direction we need to go into. And sometimes I'll tell you to try something else uh, from somebody else and over the counter, uh, like a Dr. Scholl's or something like that, to see if that starts to relieve it. If it is, then we know we can go. Question I have, I get quite often, do I have to have these inserts? Can I buy these inserts for my shoes? Yeah, if they'll fit you, buy one. Try them and see if they'll fit. Because normally, if, like I say, you put them in there, you put your foot in there, you're in a vice. You're just cramping. And again, especially diabetic, we cannot do that to you or anybody who's got bunions or hammer toes or corns. We can't do that to you because more we squeeze you, the more restricted we make this, the lack of circulation you get because the restricted area generates or creates less uh, uh, freedom for circulation. Then the whole purpose of it is thrown out the tube. So uh, we need to make sure those inserts, and I'll tell you, once I get people involved in them, they go, whoa, whoa, whoa. And I tell you, I can't go anywhere without wearing these. And I had a back problem, and I said this in another video. Uh, this year, a small back problem by picking up a luggage the wrong way. It was pretty heavy. And it torqued my back, and I wore them, got these on quickly. Uh, tried them without figuring, well, let's see what that does and everything. Put these things on and that back problem went away and never had a problem since uh, learning how to pick up a suitcase in a proper way. So uh, again, I think this information is important. I want you to know the importance of inserts. It's something I preach about, talk about all the time. I'm a firm believer in it. And this is not a scam. This is not 
quackery. Uh, this is something, again, they do wear out. They compress themselves down. They lose the circulation. So that's why we provide you three of them, like we do with diabetics as well in our medical business. You guys get the same advantage, but you don't pay the $240 for it. And it really makes a difference, and you will understand that and believe it. Sometimes we have to maybe adjust the size a little bit because of the inserts and that durometer and because of maybe edema you have, and we go into more detail. We take time in trying to find out how we can make it better for you. We're not we're not a self service operation here. I mean, I don't fit you as well, but man, that's impossible. Uh, as in the medical business, we have to. That's law. But in our thing, we can't because Alaska, or I mean, let's go anywhere, uh, uh, Florida, so on like that. But we exchange it. We can work with you. We have the measuring devices. We have everything else from that point. So. I appreciate you listening to this. I want you to know how I believe in inserts. I want you to know I'm sincere about this. I'm going to make this program work, and it is working, and it's going to keep growing. It's going to keep growing. It's going to keep growing. And in turn, if you don't think you need this, it's not your world, okay, that's fine. I'm not going to beg you, and I'm not going to keep emailing you or knocking on your door and saying, hey, how come you haven't done this or that? That's up to you. Once I get you going and you get the right proper fit and everything, you're going to understand why it has helped me over these years as well. And I put them in my gym shoes. I put them in my running shoes. I do everything else from that aspect. Also, I want you to know if you have a friend that's having serious problems or can't get fit or just has situations that they can't find the proper uh, footwear for them, please tell them about us. The word of mouth is our biggest form of advertising, and we keep doing these videos to let you know who we are. We're for real. We're not faking this. I have the credentials. I have the medical uh, company to verify the major success. We're doing the same thing in the medical as we're doing the website, and we're here to help you. And I hope that you have a great day, and God bless you.